Hi everybody, this is Tom from the Tool Development Team and I thought it would be a good idea to have a small series of tips of the day for Tool. And uh, I want to keep these videos as short as possible, so maybe I manage to make it in less than two minutes. And let's see how this goes. So today we are going to talk, talk about exporting a demo or an executable. So uh, let's start by doing something that is not related to this topic at all. Let's create a stopwatch so we can see how we're doing on time. Let's maybe reset this here. Um, let's create a, a string formatting. So we have a, a float to string. Let's change the format here to seconds. Uh, let's uh, use this for a string, uh, for text. Let's increase the size. Uh, maybe also increase or change the uh, front width here. Um, maybe pipe this into a uh, feedback effect here, because feedback effect somehow I like it. Maybe also create, uh, maybe we animate the color here of this text. So uh, let's pipe this in here. Maybe also change this to uh, a wave. So let's see what it's doing. It's doing something something peculiar. So maybe try like a bunch of different feedback effects here. Actually, oh, oh, oh no, I'm running out of time. I'm, I'm always getting, I'm, 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 uh, 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 no, this was a bad thing to start because I'm always tripping on feedback effects. So let's leave it at there. Let's say this is our demo. We take all of these and we group it. Actually, the smartest thing would be to create a layer to the here and group it like this, but uh, let's ignore this for now because I wanted to show you something complicated. Let's combine this into a new symbol. Combine into a new type. Let's call this demo example demo two. Let's add some description. A quick test by texture. Let's combine this, and we see that this it doesn't show anything because it doesn't know what to show. It needs an output. And that's why I said like, well, maybe add a layer to D and don't include it when grouping, then you will immediately have automatic an automatic output. Now we don't have this, so we have to add it. So let's go in here. Maybe we press G to format this nicely, and then we do add output. For uh, a demo to work, it needs a texture to D output. At, uh, by default, let's, these two fields will be empty. So let's look for something that's related to texture to the that's it. And let's call this output. It doesn't matter how it's called. Let's close this and there we have our output. It has the same color as our feedback. Let's connect it. And now if we jump there, yeah, my time restarted. So I guess the first video I will not make in two minutes. Let's jump out here. We have to save this once. So uh, let's press save all. And now we can right click here and press export as executable. So, oh, I forget one thing. Maybe we can already see how this is, uh, see how this is going. So tool will create a new folder called export. We can go in here and we can start the ex uh, play executable. And there's our demo. Uh, it's running, uh, it's running forever. But maybe we should also add a soundtrack, so it's a demo demo. So let's close this here. Let's go back to the example thing. Let's over open the time settings, add a soundtrack to composition, pick a file path. Let's go to user, picks to a, maybe take a, or maybe pixel was a bad choice. Maybe take a still demo here, DRD5 soundtrack. Let's take this one here. Let's, we could, I think that, BPM should be right. Sometimes if the soundtrack is being named correctly, like this one is not, uh, it would also pick up the BPM weight from the file name. So anyways, we now have a soundtrack here, we exit. Uh, let's save this one more time with Control S, right click, export as executable. Let's go back to our uh, export folder. Uh, this one will be recreated every time, so it will be deleted and fully recreated, so don't store anything permanent there, it will be lost. Let's start the player and see, oh, there we have a demo. Let's close this. So, this was the first tip 
let's see how many more there will be. I hope hundreds and hundreds and years of development. So um, thanks for watching. Uh, let's see you tomorrow. Bye.